Last week's cruise news was about a cruise line banning a very common that people bring on pretty much any cruise line. It's a standard item. That was shocking. Today is about someone bringing an item on board that um, no one should bring aboard a ship. And it's something that's clearly prohibited. So I'm going to play the video real quick so you can check out what's going on. Day two. On Carnival. On Carnival. Now mind you, check bag. They took my pickles, my hot sausages, open bag of popcorn. But yeah, we all good. Let's go, El Travisto! Hitting that song. Yep, trying to tell you. Matter of fact, let me walk on out here. So, like, literally. The cleanup. Okay, his thing got here, so he's somewhere close by. But yes, literally on the ship, guys. We finna go outside. So, this person brought a clearly prohibited item to a cruise ship. And it appears from this video that somehow she retained a gun, brought her on a ship, and not only that, it's pretty much showing it off. I mean, it's not like some of the other cruise news that happened out there, where someone accidentally brought some ammo aboard a ship, got to another country, got found, and they were slapped with some prison time, got into jail for a while, before being released. Those were legit accidents. At least that's what I see. Versus this... I'm not sure if it was an accident, and if it was, why would you brag about it? Why would you post this on social media? Why would you even think about doing that? I'm a gun owner myself. I own several guns, but I'm telling you one thing. I'm not taking it on the cruise line. I'm not taking it at the airport. I'm not taking it out the country. There's different laws and regulations around that, and it gets in very, very big trouble for doing so. And this person, I don't know if it's on purpose or not, but clearly... It's a bad idea. Carnival has banned this person, and this apparently took place back in April. So it's kind of old news, but it's resurfacing. And it brings up a good point of something you shouldn't do. And I'm not sure what other consequences this person faced besides a ban. This is easily something that can get you in a lot of trouble on a federal level. You cross international waters into other countries. I mean, things can get very bad very quickly for this person. And I still stand to why you would tell on yourself like that i mean it's by some reason somehow that happened to me by accident this is a nightmare situation and i had actually a dream about this one time the last thing i would do is post it on social media if i have an illegal item on there i wouldn't do it on purpose but it was an accident what would you post it i mean like how do you forget a gun in your bag again i can see how that one person left some ammo in a bag i keep the bag I use for my weapons it's different than the bags i use for the cruise just common sense but that's just me and it can't be any more clear that this is a banned item i mean every cruise line i have i had pictures of every single one of them banned 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 so i don't know people just don't be that person this could have gone very bad many different ways what do you think about this should the person go to jail what the consequences should be happen or is it just a happy accident where some people say that no damage was done, therefore it should be all forgiven. I mean, what do you think? Let me know down below. Just in case uh, you want a nice sunset. Can't really zoom in on there very well. Ah, there we go. If you wanted to see a nice sunset, there you are. 